Hello Year 13s. Uh, in this video we're talking about something called parametric differentiation. So in our first example here we have a parametric equation where we have y and x in terms of a third variable t and it defines some sort of curve and incidentally if you want to investigate it just make up a table where you've got um, numbers of um, t going from 0 up and then work out your x and y values and those will give you coordinates for you to work out. But that's not what we're doing here today, we're differentiating it to find um, the gradient and we're doing it in terms of t. So um, what I'm going to do is differentiate this first and so that means that dy by dt is going to be 2. And now I'm going to differentiate this, so dx by dt is going to be 8t and that's it. So what I really want is dy by dx and that's going to be dy by dt times dt by dx. Now dy by dt isn't a problem because we've got that already. dx by dt however um, is not the same as dt by dx so we need to reciprocate it to find dt by dx so that will be 1 over 8t. So then it's just a simple case of substitution and so we're going to have 2 times 1 over 8t which will simplify to 1 over 4t. And that's it, dy by dx in terms of t. So underneath here you'll see there's a formula for finding the derivative, the double derivative of a parametric term. And so what we have to do is differentiate the um, derivative in respect to t and then multiply it again by the derivative of t with respect to x. So in this example um, we're going to do that. So let's find dy by dt first, so that's this one here. So that's going to be 3t squared. And dx by dt, that's this one over here that we're differentiating, will be 2t. And so dt by dx will be 1 over 2t. So to find dy by dx we have to multiply these two derivatives together. And so that's going to be 3t squared over 2t, which will simplify to 3t over 2. So that's our first derivative. Okay, so using this formula up here, um, we're going to find the double derivative. And so to do that, we have to differentiate dy by dx. So that means differentiating this term here. And so that's going to be 3 over 2. And what we do is multiply that with the derivative of dt by dx, which we have over here. And so our double derivative, um, d squared y by dx squared, is going to be 3 over 2 times 1 over 2t, which simplifies to 3 over 4t. So it's pretty straightforward really, you just have to make sure that um, you keep track of um, what function is which and you've got some uh, work here to practice these skills.